This video is on your assignment six. So for assignment six, you are required to create a two second animation loop in Animate that meets the following criteria. So your loop must be seamless, uh, meaning, okay, so this is my, okay, it looks a little bit slow to begin with, but this is my, uh, this is actually two seconds long. I'm not sure why it's so slow, but uh, here, let me open it in a different uh, median. So Animate. And assignment, sorry about that. There we go, coffee, okay. So there we go. Okay, so this is my animated GIF that I created, okay. So you can see that it's seamless. It doesn't have a, you know, it kind of loops naturally. It doesn't have, it doesn't look abrupt at the end of, uh, at, at the end of the animation. It just keeps going on and on and there is no, beginning or end when you watch this. It just goes over and over again. So that's what I mean by seamless, okay? All right, so let's go back here. So the loop must be seamless and you must have at least five different tweens. So I'm gonna go into my animation here and show you what that means. Okay, here we go. So this is the tween, so I have one tween here, okay? That's a classic tween. I have another one, two, three, four, five, six. I have nine tweens here. Okay, so, and each tween must be on uh, a different layer, okay? Meaning, so this is not, so if I go in here, so this is, you know, this is one tween, this is on a different layer, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so I have nine tweens. You can also have nine. You can, so you can have as many as you like. You must have at least five tweens. And you must have at least two symbols, okay? So this one is a symbol. So I, when you look in your um, library, you should have at least two symbols. Here I only have, I only have one. So you should have two. Okay, of course you can have a symbol within a symbol. I could have made these kind of, um, these squiggly lines, each one of them a symbol, okay? So you should have at least two symbols. So a good way to check is when you go to your library, you should have two symbols, at least two symbols. You can have more. Next, your drawing of the symbol must be nicely drawn. <clears throat> um, if you don't understand what I mean by nicely drawn, you can post it on the discussion board. I have a discussion started for you um, <clears throat> on the discussion forum. So you can post it there and then I'll check in there and look at your drawing if it's a nice enough or not. So you can see that my coffee cup here is not very complicated, but it's a nice drawing. Okay, so what I don't want is just one um, poorly drawn squiggly line and um, have you say that that's your drawing. All right. Uh, <clears throat> next, you should have a nice background. Uh, you can you can draw this background <clears throat> if you wish to, if you want to explore your drawing skills or you can import it. Um, if you watch the other video, I show you how to import the drawing. My drawing is imported. <clears throat> I found it on Google Images. That is, um, <clears throat> sorry, that is uh, royalty free. So uh, something that I'm allowed to use that I have the copyright permissions to use it. So I import it in here and I placed it in here. So in the other video, I show you how to do that. And lastly, you must have text in your animation. You see that here I have, here I have text, right? Where's my text? There we go, Here's, I, I have hidden it. So there's my text here. Okay, so you must have text in your <clears throat> in your animation. Okay, so your drawing must be related to your theme. My, my theme for my um, for course so far for all my assignments has been coffee. So I drew a coffee cup with an animation in it. So please see my example um, and the submission. I'd like you to submit your FLA file, which is this file in the animate. So the animate file, mine's coffee.fla. And you also need to submit your GIF file, which is this one here, okay? So that's your GIF file. And when you uh, post to share, you will be sharing your GIF file in the forum, okay? So the other one that I asked you to share is, um, sorry, the other one that I asked you to share, or actually just for my feedback only. If you don't need my feedback, that's fine. But if you want to get my feedback, just uh, show me your drawing, not animated uh, yet. Just show me your drawing. Or you can email it to me if you prefer as well to get my go ahead and see if you should go ahead with that drawing. All right, so have fun with this. It is due on Friday. So you have this class and Thursday's class to work on it. If you would like some one-on-one -on -one time, please get in touch with me. We can have a Zoom session together.